Here we go, about to go live. Beer in my hand and a dog by my side. Tongue out of hell, skills out of heaven. Headphones on, stoke level at 11. Here we go, here we go, what will happen? No one knows. So sit back and relax and enjoy the show. Hello, my mic was off. Tee hee. Everyone, please note that I have colored my hair so that you do not pay attention to the socks that are on the floor behind me that I have not matched. It is an outrageous amount of socks that I have not found matches to that remain on my living room carpet. I think we're at 12. Thanks, Strike. I'm all right. Listen, focus. New hair. <laughs> Thanks. Um, yeah, it's been, um, it's been a Jan. Simone is doing really well, Mr. Yaz. Thanks for asking. Catch it him just a host. minute ago. Oh my God, that's literally me. T, um, I see your comment. I dyed mine blue. I dyed mine purple last year, you guys remember, because I was bored. Always be and I think I was really bored forever. about that. I was like, I'm fucking bored. OMGM Hawk subbed. <laughs> One month for every sock that needs is paramedic sad. Aww, that's probably accurate. So many unmatched socks. I have a little baggie for them now. I keep them in a little case and they just sit there unmatched forever. It's really sad. Um, before I finally like give up and throw them away. But I don't want to throw them away because I'm confident there's a match somewhere. Who is with Pikachu? These are my children. Unless you're talking about the Pikachu in the back. No, he's not visible right now. There is a Pikachu back there, um, but I think he's hiding. I took a nap in there the other day. Um, so when that happens, it kind of looks like a mess. Like I riled it up, but I didn't. All I did was sleep in there, but I have to move some of the pillows out of the way, and then it looks kind of meh. Anyway, yeah, I like did it last year where I dyed it purple, and it made me feel better. It honestly did. It kind of just made me room. It sounds weird, but it reminded me that I was alive because I, like, don't have a lot going on in my life. I work, like, exorbitant hours right now, and then I consume food so that I don't die, and I pet my dog, and I go to sleep, and I do that a lot, and sometimes I think, oh, God, I just am a little machine. I just work, and I sleep, and I work, and I sleep, and... I think sometimes like doing something as silly as like changing your look reminds you that you have agency over some stuff and that you should utilize it when you can. So yeah, I went to my hairdressers. They're great, by the way. I have two of them. I call them my glam squad because one of them cuts my hair and one of them dyes my hair and they're both lovely ladies. And I said I wanted to change and they said your hair is too cute to cut so we'll dye it and that's what happened. 
<laughs> yes. One time I shaved my mustache because I was bored and I looked old. Uh, I like that you did something dramatic because you were bored. I bet you look distinguished with a mustache, but it's crazy how much a uh, facial hair change completely morphs your face. Um, my uncle had a mustache his like whole life. And when he shaved it once, I was like, who is this man? Who are you? And he's the same guy, Uncle Tom, but without a mustache, I was like, who are you? You are a stranger. Um, yes, M Hog. If you see Pikachu get closer behind me and like you can see elements. Honestly, my living room, my background says a lot about my current state of being. Um, you can see on the couch, like I have like a, a blanket from probably a nap or laying down and there's socks unmatched on the floor and the, um, the nook where I like nap is just in total disarray. I think it's just obvious. I'm just a little strung out right now. Um, work is super heavy. Um, there's just a lot of pressure. Um, it's super fun to make cool stuff for people on Twitch. Like I love what I do. And so I don't want to do it badly or wrong or incorrectly. And there's a lot of like really stressful decisions that are happening right now. I have not tried the village demo. Um, Mike and I were talking about streaming it, but I heard it's only 25 minutes long. That being said, our conversation wasn't whether or not 25 minutes is long enough. It was like, do we want to save it for when it comes out and have genuine original reactions or should we do the demo and then talk about it? And we're, we're open to doing the demo. <laughs> Abby just beat it pretty quickly. I would, that wouldn't surprise me at all. I saw that she went live with, um, demon souls earlier today. I watch a lot of Abby's stuff. Like I'm kind of lurking while I'm working. The old lurk work. You guys know. You know the drill. The old lurk and work. But, yeah, just kind of a lot of work for a January. It's not a normal amount of work. It's definitely, like, almost double what I'm used to, which is crazy. So I've just been working really late hours, and I just have not had too much of a time to chill. And so I'm sorry that I missed my Merry Mondays. I love doing Merry Mondays, but I had some very important calls to make yesterday and it just wasn't something that could wait, unfortunately. As we all know, February does not move and the first is next Monday. And there's a lot of stuff to organize before that day comes. So the work continues. This is Merry Muse Day. Thank you for coming. Thanks, Strike. The Gilbert Gottfried notifications are very good. Um, the next time I do a scary stream, I will have new notifications. I don't know when that will be, but I'm gonna I wanna like revamp those. Muse Day, Saj. Who doesn't like a good muesli? <laughs> a muesli bar on a muse day. I finally caught a Saj stream the other day. You never had a muesli bar? It's a granola bar. I think that's what they call it in Australia. Tiki Tuesday. I like that. I have been told that these lanterns feel tiki-esque. Anyway. I'm playing this game again. I only streamed because you did it. Oh, God. <laughs> That's funny. I would love for you to do what you wish. That's funny, though, that that's what it resulted in. Maybe on Mondays we should just watch you instead. I am like, I love streaming and it's a joy. But sometimes, because I work at Twitch, I'm working all the time. And then I stream and it's really hard for me to get out of work mode and be like, now I'm just going to have fun and play games. And so I have to like push myself to like get into that cool mindset because I love it. You can have the Mondays. All right. Thanks, Saj.
hopefully this isn't broken. Um, can you guys hear the music? Oh, it sounds kind of loud. I feel like that's too loud. Is that too loud? You tell me. I'm going to hit continue. It's very loud. Okay, yeah, that sounds right. Very loud. Um, I'm deaf now. I'm sorry. The old audio check. I am deaf. This is probably still too loud. That's my guess. Hey, thanks, Bubblegum. It woke up my cat. Oh, no! I'm going to turn it down just a snidge more. And we'll always be friends Aw, thanks, Drake. Diddler! OMG the diddler subbed. Merrick Pika. <laughs> Yay, with the peak! The T2 with the peak. Diddler, thank you. I love that because I drew that incredible emote. Um, <laughs> my windows are shattered. <laughs> Listen, I feel like you guys are being a bunch of drama queens. OMG bubblegum tracer subbed. I have ice cream. Oh, I want ice cream. Give it to me. I haven't had ice cream in a hot minute. That ship, torn apart and cast so far up the beach. What on earth could have happened? We'll always be friends. I forgot. I hope you guys are prepared for the talk. OMG, adventure Ooh. time, sub. Yes. I'm terrified. Yes, thank I've you for the sub. I appreciate it. Something thank you very much. Someone. Seems to be moving there on the reefs. Or is it just my imagination? It's just your imagination, you crazy girl. Girl, you crazy. Oh, no, wait. That's definitely what's going on here. <laughs> There's definitely stuff happening here. I don't know what it is, though. Yeah, I totally did not forget. I was wondering what to stream tonight, and I was looking up some other games. Um, but I, you know, we didn't get that far in this game, like and I took items from the stranded ship. I felt like should I look into the ship real quick? I felt like there was good elements of this game. The things I didn't like of this game was how much she talked. I believe Harry visited this exposition when he was looking for answers for my illness. Why would you find answers to an illness? Oh fuck, I... Okay, right. Do not hit escape to back out of materials, of course. I did, I did come back. <laughs> yes, it's definitely got that 20s look to it. Also, if you guys didn't see part one of this, you do you probably do not need any concept of what we did last time to understand what's going on here. I'm on an island. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck happened to my husband. You're caught up. I'm a sassy 1920s know-it-all, and I got a cold, and my husband was trying to find the cure. And then he went to this island, and I was like, where are you at? And so I followed him here, and now I'm figuring it out. Puzz juice. A lot of these puzzle pieces are in, like, the details, so it can be a little... You know, you just kind of look, have to look at all and try and figure it out. And a lot of it's also visual, so right? I have to, oops, <laughs> I fucking cut her off. Oh well. Transparent film. Uh, Someone here had a green thumb. A portable typewriter. A portable typewriter. A pulp magazine. I love Chandra Hogarth stories. It's I have to, to try and make sure I don't miss tense. anything. I should find a way to turn. Never heard of this Eric Zan fella. Never heard of Eric Zan? Why, he's the best of the best. He knows how to play a trumpet, if you know what I mean. 
What do I mean by that? <laughs> I'll never tell. Someone took notes about some important dates. She already seems annoying. Um, she does her best. Did he take some amulets from the other campsite? Or did he carve some more? <laughs> hey, get a load of this girl. She knows how to handle herself. I'm gonna go back to the ship. I feel like I missed some important details because I walked past them. So I'm gonna go in there and just double check. This is where they ate their spam. The expedition only has five members now. Oh right, someone died um, in the expedition. We found that out in the last episode, so. Like a lot of these things are so minor, I don't know if they're important or not. Oh my god. The ship's hull was ripped open. Ripped open. A few jagged rocks couldn't have caused a gash of this size. How do you know? How do you know about ships? Gashes. If I saw a ship that was capsized with a hole in it, I wouldn't be like, that's definitely not from debris. Like, I know shit about this stuff. This lady has some guts to determine the cause of the accident. Hey, split screen. Oh, this place gives me the creeps. I'm going up a ladder, just chill out. Um. I can't see any trace of the ship's crew, nor their remains. Dang, I would not feel comfortable being in here with all this water and stuff. Hmm. No power. That's true. There's no power. No wrong. I'll try again. Okay. This is right. Oh, is this an order sitch? Hammond, I think we're back in business. Yeah, it does kind of have that Campo Santo feel, doesn't it? Because it's got first person. It's very saturated. Um, story driven. That voice. Is that Harry? A VO that won't quit. No, just a recording. Can you harass naked teens? The dream. I like when he threw the radio into the lake. Is that what he did? Yeah. Even the crew of the ship that brought Harry's expedition to this island were afraid of it. Hmm. This is the captain's last entry. 10.25 a.m. Good weather. 7.25. My first mate swears he saw a huge sea creature sh near the hull shortly afterwards. Definitely not a whale. Alright, so possibly attacked. Frank is certainly a resourceful man. I've wired up your message to the radio like you asked. It, it'll keep broadcasting as long as the ship's got fuel. God help us. Definitely a whale. Turbo, thanks for the follow. What were you looking for in the heart of the island? I was thinking this ex expedition had failed and was worried about how we'd get back home. Then I found these stairs that led me to the giant stone organ. It might be another way to get the very heart of the island. In any case, there's nothing we can do until someone hears our distress call. Um, a real hug, nice man. Thanks for the follow. I hope you're as real and nice as you say. Apparently, Harry's expedition waited for a long time to be rescued. Did they give up hope? Apparently, Harry's expedition waited for a long time to be rescued. Maybe the legend is more real than it seems. Let's see, what are we learning here? On the island of Ponape, there's a city called uh, Nan Medol that's composed entirely of large basalt structures. 
Legend has it the city was built with floating stones moved by black magic. Yeah, the handwriting These is These nice. knobs must control the vibrations inside this chamber. If he'd talked this much in Firewatch, the game would have been finding new walkie batteries. <laughs> yeah, I agree. They went a little too ham with her talking. I I am... I'm actually going to turn that off because it's annoying. Oh, look at this. The black ooze's properties are perplexing. You were listening? <laughs> he throws it to Westminster. He holds it. He holds it. He holds it. Pass forward to the front. It scores! And that's the game. I assume that's what a ball game sounds like. So this is Puzz Juice. Okay. A green light comes on when they're this high. So perhaps that's all I need to do. Make them all that height. Okay, so this does, let's do this puzz one juice at a time. It would be neat. I wonder if you can desaturate it. Um, That's a funny idea. 1920s style. <laughs> ah, and it's just like black and white. That's funny. A lot of the puller puzzles involve color cues. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, well, there you go. Okay, so this last noozle uh, does the last Two. This one does the first two, and this one does the first and the second. And now let's just continue to make the same errors in judgment. So... I want to get it to a place. Bill the Conqueror. Thanks for hanging out with me. I need to get it where the one is in the right spot. Like, let's say the middle one is in the right spot. But the first and the last one are in the same height so that I can fix it. Like, okay, like let's say like this was green here, then you just res it to that lev. Um, so we know what we want. We just gotta get there. This one is the back two. Oh, thank you, Silver. Um, yeah, I don't know if the numbers change things. That's a good question. I don't see any numbers connected to this so far.
Like, that's a good question. Because, like, I'm always touching two. So it's going to be really hard to get them all three. Rare earth magnets. These are called black ooze currently. That's where we're currently at. All right, so let's start from scratch. Toby, thanks for the follow. They're all at the bottom equally. If I raise this one, I can get too easily to the to the green, but I'll lose one here. I can make them all equal this level but can I do it where I want to this is a twisty knob situation This was the most annoying puzzle in the game, Phil. I typically don't like puzzles of this nature because they stress me out. And I suspect that something will go wrong for me. also really hard to know like how do I get this top one down it's it's too high who builds this kind of puzzle and why why are they so cruel so we can definitely get them to the correct height, but it doesn't help me solve for the issue. Like, I think what breaks my heart about this is I feel like I can tell that I'm going in circles, but I don't know how to fix it yet. But I will continue to try. Like, see how I can get them all the same height here? Like, it's definitely possible. Possible, aren't you, you little bitch? So I can definitely get them to here. What I can't, what I'm having trouble doing is getting them at the same part below. And I'm also, I don't know if you've noticed this, you probably have, that I'm making the same mistakes. Like there's been no time where I've done it correctly yet. Okay, this is the closest I've ever been. 
come on, you little bitch. No! Look how close they are! They're so close! Uh... They're off by one noozle. Fix it, fix it, fix it, fix it! Oh, fuck off, come on. You little bitch. I'll just die. I was like, I got it. Why is this one so high? Like, they're all the right size. Underrated faves of the year. I think this is really fun so far. I'm devastated that I also find that it's extraordinarily hard. It makes me feel like a big old dumb dumb. Why? I am gonna turn in for the night. Keep your spirits up, Mary. Hope you'll feel rejuvenated and inspired. Hugs hashtag SH for Subway. Bye. Bye, Invader. Thanks for hanging out. Bye, Mr. Yes. Thanks for hanging out with me, too. I'm gonna keep my spirits up. I'm not donezo yet. I'm just tired, though. But thank you for hanging out with me. I feel so fucking close, and this is actually killing me how hard this is. It's like off by one point. <laughs> I, those unmatched socks are the bane of my existence. Look at this. Just be right. Oh, okay. I fucking did it, but I have to go down one. So I did it, but I'm off by one, one lev. Okay, so I've got the back two. Those are connected. <sighs> hey, Monish. I might die here. That might just be my solution. Line them up. <laughs> I'm very close. Oh, 
Like, I'm obviously fucking close. <sighs> There's... Do you think that just undid my work? I hope not. We'll find out. There's this picture, and it says it's definitely not these. Classic. Apparently, Harry's expedition waited for a long time to be rescued. Did they give up hope? And I was completely covered in that black goo. I wonder what it'll do to me. I mean, it can't be good, lady. Oh, I think I have to go back to that puzz and just fucking suss it out. I mean, I know we can do it. It's just a bit of a slog to, like, know that I think I'm close. Unless I'm way off and I'm doing it totally wrong. Um, and I also have to say, I don't feel like I'm learning enough to do <laughs> I feel like you're not learning enough. That's why I, I currently feel like I'm at. I feel like I haven't learned enough to do this properly. It's just, this is like a classic resi Thing where it's like, just figure it the fuck out, lady. Did I ever tell you um, I took AP Biology when I was in high school and I was absolutely suffering. I was getting Ds on every exam and that was like me studying, you know, hours and hours every night and I um, I had this other dude that was like taking it to that was struggling just like me and we were both like clearly like we don't know how to do this we're just going to keep studying and hope that we figure it out and he eventually got another F and he left the class and he told me that in his you have to like resign from the class you can't just not show up because you get an f you have to say i no longer want to take this class i'm going to remove myself from this class and in the slip he wrote not smart enough and the teacher made him change it <laughs> she wouldn't sign it <laughs> And I felt so bad because I was in the same boat. And I was like, I'm also stupid and doing my best. <laughs> and we both just like suffered forever because we both cared. We thought the class was interesting. It's just really fucking hard. It's a very difficult class. This is the back too, right? Yeah. Yo, oh my God, I couldn't imagine Clay. Um, polio, that's so mean. Your teacher sucks. Um, yeah, Kanini's on hiatus right now. We will definitely, like, I promise you we'll play the new Resi when it comes out. But, like, other than that, we're still, like, talking things through. We do have plans. Like, we have, like, lots of ideas and we're talking about what we want to do. But I don't want to, like, spoil it until we've, like, discussed it as a team. But it's definitely in conversation. And we're also just, it's nice to enjoy a little hiatus before you, like, promise the next thing. But I I promise you we are dis discussing it. <gasps> oh my god, I'm so close! 
I'm not that close. I'm the closest I've been. Trailer's really good. I'm very excited. I haven't played the demo. I love the idea of um, the strategy of how to organize things again. That's very important to me. I enjoy that very much. I think the ladies in the trailer are so badass. So far away, Lord. Like, why is it so easy to make them all equal here? <coughs> like, I can make them equal. Do all the arrows need to be pointing in the same direction? I would argue that they shouldn't be close to pointing in the same direction. But I'm not smart enough to figure it out. Okay, I'll tell you what I think you're supposed to do. The left one by the end should be where it's supposed to be in the green. And then these should be at the same position. And then you just smush them there. That's what I think you're supposed to do. But again, not smart enough to understand. Why don't you just stop being such a fucker all of the time? Have you thought about that game? No. Like, look how close this is. But all the arrows are pointing in the right same direction. This can't be right. What if I'm not supposed to do this yet? No. No, that can't be right. I'm just not smart enough. Okay, I think I got it. This is based off of nothing, because I'm fucking not good at this. But here's what I think. I want that one to be in the green. And when that happens, these two need to be at the same height. Does that make sense? If I do that, are these at the same height? I fucking can't tell. I oh, I did it, I did it, I did it. In my journal. That was so hard. That was like the first puzz juice of the day, and it was so hard. Um, so this is happening, but I don't know what it is. Ah, Silver, OMG, thanks for the gift this sub. Hurts my head subbed. To always be friends forever. Won't we? OMG, Pacop, uh, and Thank subbed. you. Thank you, guys. Yay, Silver, thank you for gifting those subs. I got a redemption for a hat. Hats? I own hats. I own many hats. Give me one second. Like I don't own hats. And we'll always be friends forever, won't we? OMG Silver underscore streak subbed. 19 months. Mary has dealt with me for far too long. I apologize. Uh, sweet, sweet follows. Okay. 
Okay. This is what happens when we do hats off. I told you I got hats. I got hats for days. Look at that. That's a hat. Hey, on Secret Crush. Cool. So now that I have my hat on, <laughs> I literally cannot hear very well with this on. Uh, hydrate. I can do that. Thanks, Lord. Funny hat today is what today is. So I don't know what to do with these numbers yet. Do you think I should write them down? Oh, I would have put them in my journal. Okay. I was like, I would have put them in my handy dandy notebook. I should probably put ear holes in this pineapple. This pineapple does remind me that I am doing the third annual Fall Guys tournament. Um, Only in God knows how long I've been covered in this black liquid. Conjunction with a uh, although I doubt anything could be worse than my illness. Devolver. So if you guys are interested, it's gonna be next Thursday. Um, and I think it's gonna start rant mildly early in the morning, like 10 a.m. and go for like three or four hours. So you can just follow my Twitter because I'll probably tweet when we do it, but it's next Thursday. I'm taking the day off of work to host it. It should be fun. That is a dual mail. I really enjoyed doing it last time. Oh, I thought I turned on the power. I guess I didn't, I don't understand. Did I not do that? I thought I did turn on the power. Um, so maybe I didn't actually suss this out. <laughs> you dead game in me? Yeah, it's still around. There's still a lot of players that play it a lot. I, don't, I probably won't play it. I think I'll just be commentating on it a lot, but it's fun to watch other streamers suffer. I just wanna make sure I did this properly because I thought I turned on the power, but now I'm not sure anymore. Like, did I? <laughs> Among Us probably did. Um, Among Us ate a lot of games launches, and that game's two years old. That's been, like, a part of what made 2020 so wild was, like, all the surprises. Just so many straight-up times it was like, this shouldn't be a thing, but it is. So here we go. At last, some light. That should make things easier. All right, so this should give us some, yeah, phasmophobia was pretty shocking. I did not expect that at all. Ropes are frayed, and there are strange marks on the wooden pole. Like, what was this about? This is like they did a puppet show. don't know what this is about yet. I think I have to come back to that. Yeah, Polio, I feel like this game gives you hints, but I still find myself constantly like, wait, what did you actually want me to do here? Like, there was no context to this at all. We're definitely getting better, though. Did I, was I already in here before? I don't remember if I've searched this area. I you for the letters E D W embroidered on it. It's stained with discarded clothing. It hasn't been a white fedora. It's really dead. My lady. Oh dear. 
This dock was a certifiable loon. Um, let's see what he said. Um, okay. Okay, this guy's just saying garbledygook. These metaphors are hair raising. The doctor was certainly well supplied with all kinds of substances. This is whiskey. This is vodka. I'm glad you stayed by his side. This is Whoever cocaine. And these are band aids. Yeah, definitely, M Hawk. I feel like that's why I picked this up, was because I loved Mist. I'm gonna need three cc's of cocaine, stat! We're losing him! He's bored! These two fellows seem to get along pretty well. Frank. I like this read function. Frank and Tiahora singing while working in the shop. Two dudes hanging out, having a good time, being bros. Hey, thanks, Luis. You can't see it. How would you know how good my hair looks? <laughs> this is the new style. I know you were curious about what my hair looks like. It is the new pineapple look. All the ladies are doing it. It's very on trend right now. I questioned it. My hairdresser said that it was 100% the right call, and you just got to listen to them. We went for the pineapple. Oh, what kind of look at dude this. That is this? Okay, so two six two three four nine four one five. 262 is the bottom key. 349 is the fourth key. One, two, three, four. And 415 is the middle black key. So one, four, mid. well-tuned i expected no less from you old pal All right, that was not successful we need to figure out more of it maybe thanks nate rocks stained with black ooze looks like the prototype of something bison thanks for the follow tide levels measurements harry everhart you didn't borrow this slide projector from the university of denver old pal. oh what's these oh some triangles happening here look at this one four two two goes to three three goes to two four goes to one i mean there's all sorts of puzz juice happening right here you always did have a good ear harry how can someone build something like this out of stone Hmm. Captain Hodgson told me that knowing the lunar cycles is useful for better navigation at night. So Harry probably took this calendar from the Lady Shannon. Definitely. A rock stained with black ooze. Looks like the prototype of something. Oh, what's this? That son of a bitch, DeWitt, stabbed Frank. Luckily, it was just a flesh wound. It's a good thing they held me back, or I would have plugged that fucking nutcase like a rabid dog, that. Jesus, what am I saying? I, I've never seen Harry so angry. Oh, thank you, Louise. <laughs> Depends on your perspective, Great Polio. 
It depends on <laughs> which movie you've recently watched. Wow. Look at the size of these stones. Oh, okay. So this mm. is these symbols are linked to the piano keys. Okay, so if the piano keys and the numbers are connected, then it would be Let me get my gamer journal. Then it would be triangle with a little triangle in it. Uh, one, two, three, four. A triangle with four triangles in it. And a triangle with two sideways triangles in it. Louise, I like it. I think the puzz juice is good. I don't know if I like my the protagonist that I'm playing as. I just think she's got a lot to say about nothing. Sometimes I just like investigating the world. I honestly think I just really like a quiet protagonist. I've always felt like that since I played Zelda. I like to like put my persona in the character. So when they have a lot of character, I can't do that. So that's been kind of hard for me. That being said, the puzz juice is good and that's important. And I don't know. Um, the the world is interesting. All right, so I don't know if this is important, but uh, a triangle with a triangle in it is actually, in the arrow, a triangle with four triangles in it. So I'm just gonna draw that just so I don't forget. A triangle with four triangles in it turns into a triangle with one triangle in it. So I'll just draw that. And a triangle with two sideways triangles turns into a triangle with two sideways triangles. Okay. Weird. Okay. Wait, is this the same slide? Oh my god. There's like all sorts of different like... What the fuck? This drawing is so good. I wonder if one of these guys drew that to be... Oh, okay. Okay. Oh my god. Well, that cartoon was unexpected. And so she is naked. Well, that cartoon was unexpected and inexplicable A little nudie grinch tide level measurements so this is like what the system is based on the tide is all I can think of. So I need to put this information in somewhere. I have a whole notebook filled with information, but I don't know what it means yet. So we have to do more investigating, but I would say we're in a really good spot. Like I feel like we've investigated and done a lot so, so far, which is good, but there's still more puzzle to be had. with a free Frogurt. The Frogurt is also cars. He's repairing my old music box. Attack? What attack? What happened on this ship? Uh, an attack. So we were here before. We've read some of this. Oh my god! Look at his contorted face. Is this what's going to happen to me?
So this guy was like wicked strong. Those footprints definitely do not look human. Those pictures taken from a distance. What is he doing? Floating rocks? So this guy was like whispering to rocks and they were floating. That's what I'm gathering. There's a lot to unpack here. I wonder if I'm done with this ship section or if there's more with the ship. There's a big hook here. I don't know, I'm curious. All right, I don't think there's anything over else here. So the question is, yeah, a couple, a couple clippings. Question is, is there more deets on the ship? Oh, okay. This is saying whether it's a full moon. Okay. What day is today? What day is it? How did she, when did she say what day it was? Was that on the ship? I need to know what day today is. I need to figure out the day. Thanks, pal. My posture is very pineapple. I feel like the statue of limitations has passed on this pineapple. I'm going to remove it. It's very pineapple. That pineapple is actually not too far from what my hair used to look like. So that's a nice welcome change. Let's all have some cake. So I'm going back into the ship because there was some comms happening. And my question is, what day am I supposed to get the information from so that I know which triangle to use? That's what I'm trying to figure out. And I won't know until I know what day, but I also don't know where to input this information. That's the other component I'm lacking. I have a lot of pieces to the puzzle, but I don't know what to do with them. That's like my next issue is like, like we know that we came to here. I got these numbers. I figured out this black ooze. Fucking beat that bitch. Um, but like, what day is it? Ah, Louise. Sorry. Should I listen to this report, you think? Like, what if there's secrets in it? This is a distress call from the Everhart Expedition. 74 nautical miles east of Tahiti. The Lady Shannon has run aground. Its crew is unaccounted for. So five of us have survived. But we're stranded on this island. Please send help. Okay. This is a distress call. I don't think that that gave me any new stuff. I don't think the date that I need is here. That's my thought. It's not based on very much. So my notebook is very important. It says on the 7th it's a new moon and on the 21st it's a full moon. But what does that mean for the date? Right? Like, it doesn't say today. <laughs> He'll be like, you're not allowed to say you're too dumb. What does the moon look like now? That's a good question. <laughs> Listen, don't out smart me. <laughs> Telling me to look at the moon to know what moon it is. How dare. Fuck, that's so smart. 
There's no moon. It's overcast as shit. Egg, thanks for the follow. So there's this area to the right that I haven't really known what to do with and it seems really interesting to me. So I think we should go check it out again. Like what's this? Ropes are frayed and there are strange marks on the wooden pole. What's this all about? It's a good question, isn't it? Like, what's up with this? What were y'all doing here? I can't click on anything. So, I don't know. Hey, Super Smash Nate. It was the island strip club in the making. <laughs> We're working on it. We have rope, poles. Can't find any ladies. Jerry said he'd do it though. Oh, there's this. Oh no, I've already touched that. We keep telling Jerry no, but he keeps doing it. <laughs> This is where they ate. Like I'm super missing something. I think. Oh, I'm a fucking idiot. What's this? This looks important. <laughs> I found the secret entrance. It only took four days <laughs> to see these very big stairs. Sometimes I still doubt whether this isn't just some ghastly dream. It's very pretty. The effects that they did on this are very nice. Fuck, I can't believe I missed this. This was a very important component. This is literally what happened last time I streamed this game is I just visually missed it's something curious, obvious. It's the first time since I got sick that I feel useful. Harry is depending on me and not the other way around. What odd structure. It doesn't look like a building though. What odd structure. It doesn't look like a building though. Are you writing it down? She didn't write it down. Fuck. How did I find the most, like, obvious thing and it didn't help me? There must be more stairs or something else that I'm missing. There's a dude and he can lift rocks out of this container. What odd structure. It doesn't look like a building, though. Thanks, Super Smash Snake. I enjoy it. It's been fun to just try something new. Look, there's more stairs. This place goes deeper. Um, I can't get to it, right? I can't even fucking see. All right, so that must be later game. All right, so we have some good chunks of info. What do we do with them? That's my current query. I have... Look at that, that stone structure. Isn't that neat? This was gonna be the clubhouse, I think. And then there's like a dude that slept here. Some boxes, I just wanna make sure I'm not missing anything. And then there's some, this is like where the majority of the puzz juice occurred. We know this. Oh! 
What's up with... Am I supposed to play this, you think? Like, is it Toonski based? Okay, I think I get it. So the question is... Okay. I'm playing one for middle black, but it might not be those arrows because the arrows are based on whether or not it's a full moon or not. And we know it's a full moon. The tones it emits change constantly with the tide. Waves push through the carved stone, creating different sounds. And it's just a giant sound machine. And the sounds change with the tide. Oh my god, this is some big puzz juice. So my question is, is should I do it based on a full moon or a new moon? Probably a full moon, right? Because that's when the tide is best. Is a full moon tide level measurements? Is that empty? Or yeah, full getting less, 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 less. Full moon is when the water benders are their most powerful. It will always be friends forever. OMG pudding power 84 subbed. Hey, Asventure, thank you for gifting that sub. What a nice thing to do. Thank you for doing that. I appreciate you. I am trying to suss out this puzz juice. I don't know if I'm doing a good job. Like I am confused with what the game currently wants me to do, but I'm gonna do my best to like figure it the fuck out. And if I get really stuck, I'm gonna ask for help, but I'm gonna do my best to just, just figure it out with my brain. But I don't know if this is right. And I don't have a lot to base it off of. Um. Like, should I be playing this to try and do it? Oh, goodness. Um, it would be, if my math is right, it would be the third black key, second black key, uh, whatever this one is. Uh, in between the two black keys. I don't know if this is right. Third black key, second black key in between. So like, what am I doing? Did I, did I do that? Was this levitating before? I don't fucking remember. Yeah, it was always levitating. So I've done nothing. I think what I'm not sure right now of what to do. Can I tell you where my head's at? So we got the Hertz, the the numbers from that box. 262, 349, 415. We associated it with the keys on this chart. Right? Which we know. Uh, 
is key one, key four, middle black key. Thanks, Silver. I'm like just trying to like process how fucking lost I am. Like how, how out of the fucking spectrum am I? How, how fucking not on target am I? Cause we've done a lot. We've done a lot of good here. Like we've done a lot. Is this high tide? Is this low tide? Is this no tide? I don't know tide. We don't have enough information. Silver, I think what I wanna know is, is this puzzle about playing the right notes on that, on that piano? Is that what it's trying to get me to do? I don't understand what the end game is. That's where I'm frustrated. It's not about playing the piano right. What am I trying to solve? Um, I wanna open up that door. If that is a door. Um, what is the tide? That guy was singing to the rocks. Do you think that there's still rocks? Dude, if my husband was like cheating on me or some shit and I went to this fucking island and sat in black goo, that would be that. He'd be dead. All right. I don't know how to tell what the tide is. There would be no quartz because I'm on an island. He would just be gone. And like, what's up with this? What's this? I wonder what else could be seen beyond these shores. What's up with this thing? All right, let me ask you this, Silver. Did I miss an entire like area? Like I, I've done countless times before. Like there's an area that I just, I fucking plumb miss. Okay, fuck me. That's what I thought. I bet it's past this boat or some shit. I've done that before. There's just a lot to look at. Oh, God damn it. Look at this whole giant section of game. Yes, it was where they tied the dude up, but it's like, is that all that place was? It's lore? I guess that's sometimes where this game is a lot like Mist, because you don't know if it's world building or a fucking very important puzz. Indica or sativa? Um, man, my weed knowledge is gonna embarrass me, but I like the one where I melt in a couch, not the one where I'm active and wanna clean the house. What kind of machine what kind of machine were you building? Blowtorch. Looks like it's been used a lot. Indica is the melty one. And I'm an indica person. Um I like have like a very common order and I just go get it and I feel like I don't know enough about it. Look, they had power in here. A burned photo. I can't make out what's in it. Um Well, this area was unhelpful. There it there is a giant structure. With goo coming out of it, and I don't think I can get over there. I 
it's really easy for me to miss a door too. Like that's a classic Mary move is to miss something so obvious because I just missed it. I might have to turn this light on or something. I don't know. been interested in knowing how things work the since old I was a child, red button but issue I always thought technology wasn't for me what nonsense oh lady it's so foggy up here oh fuck this area is huge I missed so much look at this that huge stone door looks like an exit how does it open how do you know if it's an exit how does she know that Doors can look like exits or entrances. Like, how would you know? The structure certainly isn't natural, but not man-made either. How do you know that? How does she know all this stuff? Uh, it's happened a couple times. Ominous. Polio. Danger. I wonder what that does. I guess I'll touch it. I wonder what this does. I guess I'll touch it. Um, Must okay. Must be instructions to operate this bizarre structure. Open is structure. up. Closed is down. Turn, tune in the organ by opening and closing right tubes. The right tubes. Open. I just want to make sure I didn't miss anything because I keep doing that and it's kind of important that I stop missing areas. So that's closed. Open. And then where do these steps go? Open. Okay, and then that was broken and that's where I was. Okay, I understand. <laughs> Is that me? Which character am I in Temple of Doom? Ooh, what's going on here? Okay, okay. We're learning very little, but some. Let's go down these stairs. We haven't seen this yet. Open. Those symbols seem to indicate the height of the tide. Okay, okay. Okay, so we're, we understand uh, I don't know exactly what's going on, but we've gotten a very important piece of the puzzle here, which is that we know the tide, finally, which should indicate... which pieces to open? Which, which pipes to open? Um, I opened up a bunch of your pipes. Fucking nothing. So, unfortunately, I have to go... Okay, open. I have to go back... The one that pushed all the buttons. I pushed the button. 
I have to go back as far as I know. I don't know if this is right or not. I'm doing this like off of the cusp, but I'm quite scared of storms. When I was a child, I used to I literally don't care to not listen to the noise of thunder. Okay. I honestly That's doubt not... I'd like to cover myself with anything in here. Time to overcome my fears, I guess. That's not good lore, and I'll tell you why. Every child has typically like a fear of thunder or lightning. This is like not giving me added pieces of information that help me understand her. It's just, to me, it feels like it's just fodder to like fill the time. And I would rather the time not be filled than learning about like the fact that she liked cheese sticks. I don't care. Okay. Okay. The tide was at the second lowest. I think this is the right one. Yeah, okay. And then we know that it's a triangle with a triangle in the middle of it. And that converts to triangle with an up and down arrow that looks like um you know like a button on an elevator there was a triangle with four triangles in it so that converts oh my god that converts to a triangle with a triangle in it and the last one is a triangle with a left and a right arrow on it and that converts to a triangle with just two triangles next to each other in it. And I don't know if this is right. Oh yeah, I do mean a diamond. <laughs> What's a diamond? I'm basing that off of this puzzle that we solved earlier, which is that 262, 349, and 414 are one, four, and here, this guy. And if that's the case, then it's triangle, up and down triangle, Wait, is that right? Oh my God, how bad am I at this? No, it's one for this one. So that's one triangle, four triangle, left and right triangle. Triangles are everywhere. So if that's the case, I need to find those diamonds. <laughs> it's like so unnatural for me to say diamond instead of triangle. I gotta go find those diamonds and open those but close all the others and that when the tide comes in should make the tone that opens up the thing that progresses the story that gives me more puzzle that helps me find my lost husband my diamonds my diamonds That was a good episode of The Simpsons when they like determine that that lady's actually bad and they don't know what to do about it. And she's like, what if I just gave you diamonds? And they like kind of look at each other and they're like, we're gonna accept the diamonds. All right, so two diamonds next to each other. We want this open. A diamond pointing left and right. We want this closed. I can't see. Just double checking that there's nothing hidden down here. There is. Four diamonds. We want this closed. Yeah, the Jane Goodall lady. Like, what the fuck is this, though? I don't know yet. All right, anyway. A diamond with four triangles in it. This is a turn off. <laughs> I just like realized what I'm doing. This is a turn off. Up and down. This is a turn on. Uh, okay. Those symbols seem to indicate the height of the tide. Hey, cream cheese is here. Hey, how are you? 
How is everybody? Thanks for hanging out. Um, we're playing this puzzle game again. Um, thank you for the shout out, Silver. Everybody go check out Cream Cheese. We like him. I'm using my Puzz Brain. We're trying to get past this Puzz. It's not uh, a smooth one for me currently. So I closed that. I closed that. And this one I kept open. Am I doing this right? I don't know. Yes, thank you for gifting OM that sub. sub. What a nice thing to do. Thanks for doing that. But now you have him. Did I do it? I did it! I did it with poise and purpose. Well, I definitely didn't just accidentally come across it, if that's what you mean. Genius! 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 Fucking genius, Lord Crashington. Thank you for the biddies. As thank you for the biddies. I love this. Translation and all. Dude, and even though, I was just gonna say, even though I think I did need one, I think I asked you, did I find all the spots? I fucking solved all the pieces, I think, with my noodle, which is very nice. First try. Oh my God. What is this? Why is this here? My dear old pal. Hello. I think I'm getting closer to understanding what is happening to you, but it is taking a toll on my sanity. As fascinating as this island and its ancient and unfathomable check. wonders may seem, it's also a place Posture's plagued with misfortune and calamities. We <laughs> lost Roy at the campsite. Creamy using my drinking one? That's one of my faves. Speech. The doctor went mad. Butt is the number one emo, according to my review. And all because of this island, Nora. Initially, we were optimistic and in high spirits, but now we've oh, all good. become resentful and discouraged. It is puzzle. Even time. I can feel how I am constantly assaulted by dark thoughts. Anyway, dark if what thoughts. What I'm going through here helps me find you a cure. It'll have been worth it. I hope to find an answer in the temple on that mountain peak. Love you always, Harry. My poor Harry. He is worried, exhausted, disheartened. Stupid. I will find you, my love. Wow. Let's see what the next one does. Yeah, the illustrated story bits can take you out. It's nice to have the lore, but I don't always know what it's adding. Ah, uh, me, 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 me. the hole I'm not sure why but I don't feel this island is dangerous maybe it's because I haven't spent as much time here as Harry did yeah they just let him out all right so <clears throat> 
this is definitely the next area. Remember when she said this was the exit and I was like, maybe it's the entrance lady. Like, who are you to say? We're about to find out what's in this place. I am going to pee and I don't want to start a new section without getting ready. So I'm just, I'm, I'm not ending the stream. We're going to keep going. I'm just going to go to the bathroom and we earned a success video. So I'm going to play it. So I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. We are the best. We did that puzzle well. That went well. You'll never say that it's a lack of trying We don't always get it done But when we do, I think we have a bit more fun That went well Okay, I thought I was going to finish making this drink before that video finished, but it didn't Boots, we back at it. <laughs> oh, Kareem, you like that? I have a whole slew of dog videos. too far with my new button presses oh good we really like dogs here too we big fans I'm just making a drink for myself because I deserve it I'm making a vodka and ginger beer with Bundaberg I used to drink these a lot when I was in Australia is there anything happier than a dog? They're pretty happy. Simone is not around right now. Oh God, hurry up. Thank Don't you! Don't me. Bundaberg is the best. Okay, I got it. <laughs> Imagine if I couldn't open this. As! Thank you for the biddies, the Bundaberg biddies. I do, I do really like Bundaberg. Not that people ask me very much what ginger beer I like, but it's definitely Bundaberg. That's the one for me. Yes, this is the counterpoint. This is just vodka, uh, lime juice, and ginger beer. It's, oh God, I got ginger beer on my mic. It'll be fine. Uh, Bundaberg rum will get messy. It is called a Moscow mule is I think what it's probably called if you get it in a bar. That's my guess. Yeah. And it's good. It's a good drink. Um, I don't always feel like drinking it because it's very sweet. Um, but I felt like it today. I've been trying to drink less sugar because I'm I'm not sleeping well at night, and I think it could be sugar related, so I've been trying to avoid sugar. But last night, I got some of the best sleep I've had in weeks. Um, I just got like, I think maybe nine hours, but 100% eight solid hours where I was out. And I feel so good that I just feel, feel like breaking my habit and then taking a lot of sugar and ruining this progress. You know what I mean? Let's go. Woo! <laughs> the end. <laughs> ah, cool. Whew, that was quite a hike. Cool, so we're in the new area. Oh, thanks, Crab. I like it too. I appreciate you saying that. 
Yeah, um, I'll never forget my entire life. I never had like coffee or caffeine. My mom was just like, no, you can't have that. You're a kid. And then like never had it in high school. I was in college and people were drinking coffee all the time in college, but I had never had a cup. And I was like, I feel like it's time. And so I just like went to a coffee shop and had a coffee. And I wa remember like walking home and not being able to control my hands and being like, what's happening to me? And then I got addicted and now it's fine. I'm at the top of the mountain. I can see that giant diamond I, shaped thing really close from here. I think that it's crazy how easily we um, socially accept addictions to caffeine. Um, and had accepted socially addictions to nicotine, but then we're like, being addicted to like <sighs> cocaine is totally not Took cool. Well like a lot there. of it is just views are worth social. It. It's just a social difference. In fact, having like a snuff box used to be like totally normal not that long ago, right? It's all these social constructs that we determine what things are acceptable and which things are fucked up. Um, I think getting addicted to anything is bad, but I think that there's certain things that are more likely to fuck your shit up. I think that like getting addicted to coffee probably isn't good for you like health-wise, sure but it won't ruin weeds. your life. Um, but it could probably. I think getting addicted to anything could probably ruin your life. Uh, I don't feel any more awake after drinking coffee or jittery or anything. I'm addicted to pants. I wear them every day. I can't stop. Oh my God. Did this just crash? <laughs> I think my game crashed. I have fucked up on the ladder. The ladder animation is broken. You would think, oh my God. You would think that it would have saved in the new area, like an auto, auto save, right? Like an auto save would have happened in this new area, right? Right? Because I have to, I have to, I have to quit. If I lose that progress, I'm going to be pissed. Okay. Don't, don't fuck with me, game. All right. It auto-saved. Bow show. Okay. Now let's use the ladder. What else am I addicted to? I'm addicted to crop tops. I wear them like every day now. They're so comfortable. I'll never cover my belly button again. Let it breathe, I say. Um, I'm addicted to... I feel like I'm addicted to dessert after dinner. I feel like if I don't have at least something after dinner, I feel like I didn't... Dead as a doornail. Dead as a doornail. I feel like I didn't finish the day. Uh, I would say this probably isn't good, but I would say I'm mildly addicted to alcohol because I drink almost every day. I don't drink a lot, but I like to have a drink when I'm done with work to help signify that work has concluded and I'm allowed to get saucy. That is important to me as a person. Um, I think I'm addicted to being with my dog. I am pretty weird if I don't hang out with him all the time. Maybe I'm making the word addicted too loose, but... I need him in my life because he's a good boy. Dead as a door now. No power. That's just love. Um, I'll have to use the ship's turbine and juggle with the things I got from the ship to make this work. So I'll have to get power somehow. Harry is convinced the answer to my illness lies inside that temple. Got to open that door. 
Nakal? So this is like Atlantis, but in the Pacific I'm not reading Ocean, all this. right? I just don't want to. Um, yeah, it has, Greg. It has for me. And you know what else? Sometimes, you know when they I was like, I like to have dessert after dinner? This tower to reproduce the effect of the organ. I consider Very a clever old pal. I consider a drink, like an alcoholic drink that's got like a little bit of sweetness to it, like this, which counts as like a sweet, nice dessert at the end of a meal. Like I'll have like a meal and then like have like a nice little drink with a little bit of sugar in it. And it's just like, cool, that's my day. I think I have to face it. I'm addicted to love. What else am I addicted to? I definitely have a coffee every morning when I wake up. Every morning. I wish I could tell you I'm addicted to exercise, but I just fucking do not exercise enough to earn that Those right. spirits are obvious in this photo. What was wrong with Frank? He looks so thin. We need to figure out how to power this bitch. Addicted to exercise is good. I wish I was more into exercise. It is like a bit of a thing. Oh, she did Looks not like want that photo taken. Snapshot. She doesn't look at all. Well, yeah, I don't fucking do that. Um, I've been trying to wake up early and exercising in the morning, but if I don't sleep, then I will not wake up. And that is not good, right? It's like all connected. If I don't sleep well, then I have trouble waking up and I have trouble exercising before work. And then it's a downhill. The whole thing is just like. But my perfect day would be getting up earlier. Exercising for like an hour and then working. That would be better. Oh shit, did oh another no. fucking person die? Frank died. Oh, Frank had a daughter named Evangeline. What a darling. That's not fucking good. So this is the second death that this team has had. Yeah, can I get some uh, Fs in chat for Frank? Literally. I built a turbine to generate electricity F under the for Frank. Water, but the stream isn't close enough to the wheel. The stream isn't close enough to the wheel. Right. Yeah, you can also use the rip emote. Both are valid. This dumb puzzle. <laughs> oh, Bill. Oh, this fucker. The Bible. It must have belonged to Frank. Tried to do something with this wound. wound. But it kept getting worse. I feel worse every day. Blood soaked rags. Okay. So. Okay. I would suspect the first thing I need to solve is power. I don't know how to solve this, but this is the first step. Okay. What just happened? Okay. These levers connect those gears to direct the wheel's energy into the turbine. How do I know if this hole is in the right spot? or not. Oh, okay. One out of three ain't bad. <laughs> so I got one right? And the holes at the bottom? Is that... Hmm. Thanks, Kareem. Thanks for hanging out with me and stopping by. It's great to have you here.
I don't like that they make me walk all the way to the other side to see if it's right. Okay, so that one's right, that one's wrong, and that one's wrong. And also, what does that mean that it's right and also wrong? Um, I would say my first confusion here is that I don't understand what I'm fixing. That would probably be my first question, is what the fuck am I actually doing? Because, like, only one of them is right at a time. So how do you know... I must be missing a piece of information. There's fuck all in my notebook. Uh, what am I missing? There's some puzz juice up there. Um, I don't know what that means yet, but there's definitely some puzz juice up there. Oh, what's this? Is this new? Okay. There's a man uh, with another man, and this guy has a person in chains. It seems kind of fucked up. And there's four squares I can touch. So there's that. There are some sort of sound devices built around this amphitheater. Oh, there's one here. It also has the same image. I think, is there anything different between the two? Yeah, in this one, it's got a perp, uh, <laughs> it's got a diamond with a line on the right side and this one has a diamond with a circle ha not full and a circle full all right it's being logged in my handy dandy notebook homemade loudspeakers probably to amplify the sound yeah no fucking duh god damn it interesting speakers they must have wanted to be louder Homemade loudspeakers. Probably to amplify the sound. Dead as a doornail. Yeah, I know. So I guess you used the notes from the organ and they weren't the right ones. Jane, you ignorant slut. That that rock side could have killed everybody. Uh... So I am going to have to figure out the power situation. Why did they do this? Probably to amplify their sound. Like, why did they want to amplify their sound? Okay. Here is a diamond with a line through it. And then there was like, I don't know. Oh, there's some puzz juice. There's a symbol inside. Okay, so these are the ones, these are the symbols that I've seen here. I'm missing one of these boys. A homemade lever, probably to this get leverage. Than any I've ever seen. 
Um, so we are missing one of those drawings. We need to establish a power source. Um, there's definitely a lot to do. Oh, okay, this Heavens. one fell. Looks like a rock slide crushed all the tents. All but one. Oh, there's a little photo. Little... Torn picture. Maybe the Polynesian guy didn't like people taking pictures of his scar. Is it the a broad that assumption? Came out of the rock slide in one piece is the one filled with amulets. Diary. Uh, application for School of Engineering. They didn't You've been Frank in the university. Denied. They should be ashamed. Ugh, all right, lady. Okay, and here's the final piece. Okay, I don't know what this wants me to do, but my guess is if this is the symbol and it's on the left that I want the left touched. That's where I'm at. Right? Like, I don't fucking know, but that's my guess. Did you guys see, there was like this um, really funny, uh, it was a tweet of a TikTok of a woman watching someone else do a puzzle wrong and it was like game designers watching QA test their product and it was just showing how fucking miserable she was watching people not understand what the game designer wanted them to do this is the one with the line through it so it's the bottom and it was just a very funny the shape puzzle the square goes into the square hole now the rectangle goes into the square hole and she's like yes yes and then he's like now the triangle goes into that's right the square hole and she's like no and she starts like crying and stuff and it's just a very funny experience to like see probably everyone like have a sadness to them it's interesting they put it in two locations i i wonder thank you lily girl i appreciate that um i wonder if they put it in two locations because they found with users that some people looked here and some people looked here and they found that it would be better if some people found it so they put it in both locations so that there was less of a chance that you just didn't find it that would be interesting but what do i know i'm just a fucking idiot all right so on the right and that one's on the top did these stone columns just fight it amazing the hatches are opening it's a very funny video I almost want to play it before we're done here. It's just a very, it's just a very funny thing to experience. That's right. It goes into the square hull. Okay. So did I solve puzzle A? No, I did. I'm fucking so goddamn smart. Okay. So I did some parts. I got this rotating. So I need to get this boy to work. Okay. Donk, donk, bitch. Um, I don't remember. I think it was the bottom, but I could be wrong. Oh my god, first try. Oh my god. <gasps> I'm so fucking good at this game. Alright, we're doing great. Balls. <laughs> I was doing so well. Right, I'm gonna say it's there. Aw, oh, dunk. Thought I had it. I got greedy, y'all. It wasn't when it was on the top. Is it in the bottom? Huh, okay. that was easy. It was easy. Oh, 
Oh shit, that's not how that works. Okay. Oh, Luis. Um, I hope you have a good night and get some rest for your eyeballs. I actually fully understand. Hey, everyone. Because that was a part of why I needed the break yesterday. Was because I was staring at my computer all day. Thanks for the biddies. I thank you so much. It's always nice. Sweet, sweet flowers. Um, Tanner, thanks for the follow. It's always so delightful to have. Oh fuck to do something with your hair and have people at work or people at your friends like say These oh that's nice like you did something different it's just like line. a nice feeling to have people like notice so i appreciate that you noticed oh fuck what is this oh no is this the same puzzle as the last one press around Oh no! Okay, I know what kind of puzzle this is. I'm not saying I know how to do it, but I do understand what's happening to me. And I don't like it. Sometimes we just want to make all the lights go. Woo. Do you think I should do this with pure wit? or by clicking really quickly and hoping that it happens. I got it. I had it ages ago and I just didn't understand that I had it. Once you had the one lit, it was solved. I just didn't understand that when I had, yes, like, yes, Sonar, I had it three times before and I didn't process that I had, when I had the one lit, I was like, this is annoying to only have one lit, but that's actually what you want is to have one lit because it, it highlights the one it's on and the one to the left and the right. And there's seven. So you just wanted to find out how to get one lit. I did it. Now everything should be powered. Okay. So this powered multiple pieces. It's powered. It's like powers Frank's grave. Um, it powers I'm really this sorry space. About Frank. Harry doesn't have many friends. When you finally do get to know him, he's so witty, so funny. A loving person, but it takes a lot for him to open up. All right, I actually don't care. And again, I find that lore like not helpful. Like a lot of this lore is like, <sighs> he was tough and it's just like, okay, why are you adding this? I don't need all of this detail. In fact, I enjoy learning the detail like in subtle ways, not in literal ways. Did I ever tell you guys that the old owner of GameSpot.com was named um, Michael Powers? That was his actual human name. Oh, what? Did I do something wrong? Come on, work. Come on. <laughs> oh, fuck. He was a nice person. 
But it was always shocking how often I've had bosses that have like, almost cartoon no. boss names. What's happening this time? Don't Where? punch a fuse box. Wait. Where am I? I can feel the fever rising. I can no. feel the fever rising. Is it coming back? Is this an ocean? An ocean that dried up. Dude, I felt multiple times like this game was amnesia. Now we discussed this. You guys okay. said that you'd be down for me to play Amnesia again. And I'd be down for playing it again. Um, the sequel, sorry. The one that just came out where you're a pregnant lady. I played it maybe once or twice now. They're so dry. I need to find water. So dry. <sighs> My bed. Another man. How many times did I think I was going to die lying in this bed? It's getting too real. So she's like in a fever dream. I played it and got all the endings. Cool. I'd better find some shade before I dry right up. Dude, this is so ambitious. Oh, she's pillar and that diamond shape again. I've got I none of the endings. More of this. I feel woozy. Am I supposed to be hiding from the sun? Because I don't understand. Is that a house? I mean, girl, you definitely dreaming. That's not a house. That's our house in Englewood. Am I dreaming? Or am I just losing my mind? Uh, Harry? Uh, are you home? I miss you so much, old pal. Old pal. I hope someone calls me that one day. I am definitely losing my mind. I don't understand what is happening, Harry. Are you... The Everheart too soon. <laughs> what a duo. Hello, my baby. Hello, my darling. Harry gave me this necklace after one of his scavenger hunts. What necklace? This is a photo of a tree. Oh, I see. It's in her hand. Okay. <laughs> I was like, bitch, that's a Christmas tree. You can't wear that. It's a photo of my mother and me. She had just gotten worse from her illness. The happiest day of my life. Nah. My mother's music box. Yet again. Why do birds? I don't know this. What tune. a sweet melody. <laughs> Checkmate in three moves. Oh, okay, that's the end. I was not able to see everything in the room because I didn't know the order in which ending the, the dream. Came over, man. Okay, that's the uh, tune that's playing right now. What, what was that? Another vivid dream? You were electrocuted. In my music box again, but... It wasn't broken anymore. And what a I'm not going back up there. The fuse box is already providing electricity to this entire setup. I've lived more in these last two days than in the previous six years. All With right. my illness, I'd forgotten about the kind of person I am. I might not be daring, but I am determined. Love gave me strength, but it also gave me something to lose. I actually think the voiceover harms this game. I, I don't want to hear that stuff. I just like experiencing this, this cool game 
and I don't need someone telling me that she's having a now tough that it's time. With water, it looks like a baptismal pool. Like I, I get it. I wish you could turn off VO. Um, this is interesting because there's water coming in this one, but not through this one. Is it broken? It's weird. It's just like overflowing or something. Oh, right. It must have been coming from here and the landslide fucked it up. So some stuff we're can we're looking for now is we want to open up this door these dudes construct constructed this is making noise i didn't know that um these dudes constructed this to make a tune or a sound through these speakers that they thought would turn on this door. All right. Can you turn it on, Cass? Please, sir. We should not do this. Not now. Haven't we had enough warning, Mr. Everhart? What else do we need? Another death? Oh. Listen to me. Frank lost his life setting this whole thing up. So we're not going to discuss it anymore. We're going to activate it, period. That's clear enough for you. Are you hey. Mom, fine. Same to you. Please, cast activate. And we'll always be friends forever. Bill. OMG, Bill the Conqueror subbed. Bill, thank you for the sub. I really appreciate that. I'm glad you're hanging out with us tonight. I know that you know this game quite well, so it's kind of cool having you here. There's something wrong, Harry. It's the ground. working! The ground is shaking. No, no! No, 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 our tent! I told you with a heart. You damn fool. You're going to kill us all. Turn it off, turn it off! Okay. So, so I guess you used the notes from the organ and they weren't the right ones. Okay. He used the notes. They weren't the right notes, and it caused this landslide and almost killed them. Why do since I got birds but suddenly Let's give it a shot. appear? Came when I realized it was a video game. That was quite a show. I guess I'm confused. I sang the song from my music box. Is that what happened? Why would it be the music box noise? I guess that's another question for another time. Homemade loudspeakers. Oh, God damn you. Probably to amplify the sound. On to the next one. This feels like hallowed ground. How is this grass possible? Puzz juice? Are they bathing him? In black ooze. I don't know if that's what I would have gathered from His this. hands are changing, like in my dream. 
Oh, they're webbed. I see. Look at those spots. They look like mine. Is this about me? Now he's some sort of man fish. I'm a fish frog. And like, look at these. There's some deets in here. Fish of every size and shape. That's the final step. Upper floor? This looks like the same kind of elevator that was in the campsite. Tunnel. Another elevator. Mechanism around floor. <laughs> These patterns look too familiar. Fish. Fishies. Harry's been up she there for three days for now, and he won't answer me. What did he find? If, if I could go up. All right, so this is a puzz. No, okay, it's not a puzz. This is taking me. Natural elevator. No thought necessary. Shut down your brain. Go up. Looks like I'm inside the giant fish head that I saw from below. Okay. Water animal. Harry marked this symbol for a reason. I'd better write it down. Okay. One, two, three, four. A complex pattern. I don't think it's that complex. He clearly put numbers on it. Symbols out the wazoo. Oh my, okay. This moves a diamond around this circle. Okay. It's amazing how words and symbols can keep their meaning after thousands of years. Okay, so a diamond with a curve life alive or like plant <laughs> birth feelings green here comes the fish battle all right and then he was sleeping here transformation this one was easy, I think evolution To a butterfly. Okay. I can't pick any of these up. With this pipe over it. This is an important letter. My dear old pal. Nora. <laughs> I wish I could write something My old else. pal. But a long time ago, I promised you I would never lie to you. So here goes. There is no cure for your illness. What you carry in your blood is changing you. And it will keep changing you until it's done. Whatever that means. There is nothing we can do to stop it. My dear old pal. My partner. The love of my life. I am so sorry. My bad bitch. So my ride or die. All those deaths because of me. Frank. DeWitt. Roy. All for nothing. Maybe Teoharo is right. Maybe we can return to the beach and build a raft to get back to Papiete. Maybe in less than a month, I could be back. There's no cure? But, but he didn't finish the letter. What did you do, Harry? Where are you? I have to know! I'm for sure that you didn't go back home, so what? What do I do now? Are you still on the island? I have to find you. Who, God's blood. those who have God's blood does, are destined inevitable transformation that, into water animal to, somehow, to, to eternal to life live forever. All right. Is this in my journal? Because this is super important. This one was really hard to figure out. Good job, Harry. I mean, you didn't do any of the work. Well done, Harry. A plus B equals A B. Out. Their language works by combining different symbols to create a new one. Ideograms. 
John McComack's dear old pal of mine? A favorite song. I've been got something in my pocket for you. Why do you not you reach in and see what it is? Give it a little squeeze and say, how do you do? I got something in my front pocket for you. I've seen you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's a classic song, Silver. Oh, no, 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 wait, wait! I forgot that that was the elevator down. Okay. So, I have a lot of puzz juice here. I've got transformation, liquid life, eternal, combining symbols, creates words. What I don't think I understand is what, okay, this is important. So, okay, this is important. Oh, is that just what it was when she found it and originally drew it? I understand. Okay. So. We have a lot of puzz juice. Let's figure this the fuck out somehow. There's a lot going on here. Um, transformation, liquid life, eternal. <laughs> this puzzle is going to have something to do with combining words to make a new word like it's they've made that very clear that that's a huge component of what's going on here what I don't actually understand yet is what my goal is right like is my goal to put these stones in the right quarter plus I've, the buttons aren't buttons. So this is what's interesting to me. Another thing that I'm noticing that's important here is I think this is a directory. So see how it's saying the diamond is on top and it's saying one, two, three, four, and the quarters are one, like left, right, down, left, right. Normally when I do a puzzle like this, I would be like one, two, three, four. I would do it clockwise. This puzzle is saying, this is one, this is two, this is three, and this is four. So in this one, the three spot is blank. <laughs> Ironically, I would also consider it the third spot if we did it clockwise. But in this one, it would also be one. Um, but in this one, I would say that the four spot is blank. Yes, it's math quadrants. One, two, three, four. Um, I'm getting a lot of an idea that, like, I understand that these puzzle, these, sorry, these puzzles, these pictures are representative of words, and we understand that. I'm 
what I don't think I understand yet. Is what, is this puzzle all based on these being in the right quadrant? Is that what this is? I do not know. So transformation is two. Let's just go to transformation. It looks like Ray's hitting a bunch of people. Oh, it's this one. Okay, good. Oh, there you go. This is transformation. The star is in quadrant four which says eternal life. This is so complicated. Um, he, I, he did say that he was writing down the symbol water animal and we did write it down. This is water animal here, and here it is. So we know the answer to all these symbols. God's blood is one. Destined, inevitable, or transformation, two. Water animal, three. And eternal life is four. I would assume that God's blood means that black ooze, and that means that you're transforming, you become a water animal, and then you, like, live eternally. I just like totally got a throwback to like when I was in church camp. I know that sounds weird, but I actually attended a church camp when I was younger and we had to sing a song about living eternally. Cause that's what you do in church camp. Sometimes when I sing those songs from my childhood, I recall what happened to me, <laughs> which is that I was indoctrined to recall Bible verses for fun, which is what I did. Who, those who have God's blood are destined inevitable transformation into a water animal and to life eternal. So this is about- So that's how you oh, mark fuck. the symbols okay, orientation. This is important. I needed to open this. Uh, right. Rotating the north of the wheel causes the symbol to change quadrant. Okay, so you're rotating the North Star. <sighs> Rope courses, yeah, oh my God. We had to do those too. I remember in school, we failed our teamwork rope course challenge and our teacher was like, oh my God, we just didn't get it in time. So. Just so that I feel like I understand, if the North Star is in the position to the right, it would just mean that the star, instead of being in position four, it's now in position two. Is that what it's doing? It's making you like turn your head? Uh, yeah, what was the church called? It was called... Um, it was called Camp Awana. Awana Camp. Yeah. I remember because there was a camp in TV called Camp on Awana. We hold you in our heart. Okay, it was like that, but it was called Camp Awana. Do you think that these symbols on the ground have something to do with it? That's another question. Or can I do it just based on this? A packaged thing. Uh, rotating the north wheel causes the symbol to change quadrant. Let's just do one and see how we feel. Cause like, it's very, there's a lot going on mentally for me right now. And so this one is life. And this is saying we want eternal life, 
which is four. Oh my God, I actually don't understand. This one I'm getting a little stuck on. Why are there three stars on life? Why are there three stars here? Is this all about having the quadrant in the right quadrant? Also, is this about solving the fucking, uh, uh, language? Like, should I be trying to read this? That can't be what the game would ask you to do. It would never ask you to read this, would it? Yeah. They wouldn't dare. There's nothing about this so far that has made me feel like I'm supposed to, like, learn the language. This puzzle must be asking something else of me. But what I don't understand is the star pieces. Why are there two stars in liquid? Why are there three stars in life? Why are there three stars in eternal? Why is there one star in transformation? Let's go back to transformation. Oh, I'm at transformation. Okay, I'm learning a lot. There's a butterfly and a snake and a fish frog and everybody's happy is this like about how many words it is like what is the star portion also is there more this is what happens to me every time is there more and I'm missing it do you know what I mean like did I miss other puzzle uh, Silver, you can answer this because I trust you. Did I miss a section and I don't have all the information or do I have what I need and I just need to fucking suss it out with my brain? Like if I missed something, it's important to know that because I don't want to like sit here and try to like gnaw on this puzzle if I'm literally just missing something. Like, see how I've written down that this means life? Because it's written, it's literally on the tree. But what I don't think I, I understand yet. Uh, yes, Polio, you can give me a loose hint that's in my journal. I think, is it the pool symbols in the journal? In the It can't be the pool symbols. What I'm interested in is these star patterns. Like, what's up with the star situation? Why are there three stars here and only two here? Okay, so it's saying life. This symbol here in transformation is the symbol here. 
And it's saying that it's in the lower right. Uh, uh, in transformation, let's go back to transformation. It's in the lower right, that's correct. And it's saying, turning this to the right. Is the world changing? It's saying turning the diamond to the right. Now makes the diamond that used to be in the lower right in the upper right. Like rotating your head like this. Why do you want the star in the upper right? Fuck. Is it because on this, transformation is upper right? Oh my god. Okay, I think I get it. Okay. I got it. Let's do a two next, because this is a fucker. Let's go to liquid. I think I understand. Hey, Silver. It's funny. I didn't know you were gone, and I asked for, like, um, like a small hint. And um, Polio helped me out a little bit, because I was like, I don't want to give it away. I just don't understand what these quadrants mean. And I understand now. It's based on these number patterns. So... Liquid is two. Liquid can mean two combined. And I need to put it in the right quadrants. Liquid to me could be God's blood and water animal because that's. Those are both liquid based. So I would say it should be in quadrant one and three, which means the diamond should be. Uh, north. Well, it depends. Yeah north this not might not be right I'm just kind of still processing what I think this game wants from me um, because I'm not actually sure yet um, this one is life it's got three and it wants it in quadrant one two and four um, How do you know which? No, it's fine, Silver. Your dogs are mostly the most important. They deserve that walk. You've made the correct choice here. So this is life. It needs three to be right. But what is life? What? What is life? Eternal life is definitely life, so that it has to be four. Uh, animals are alive. So what's more alive? God's blood or transformation? I don't know. And am I overthinking it now? Like, this is definitely life. Combining symbols creates words. Which symbols create life? <laughs> what 
is life. Like, is it... Let's go to Eternal. I'm actually stuck on that one. That one's hard. Um, let's try this one. This one's also a three boy. It's Eternal. Combining symbols creates words. I would say eternal life is eternal. <laughs> I would say destined is eternal or inevitable is more eternal. And I would say God's blood is eternal. I wouldn't say that water animal is eternal. Oh, so one, two, and four. This is hard. If I wanted one, two, and four, it would be one, two, and four. It would be one, two, four. So it would be exactly where it is right now. So that one could be right if I'm doing this right, but I don't actually know if I am. This is the right one. Oh my God. <laughs> I was like, if that one's right, then I'll just rotate the other one until something happens. <laughs> my puzz brain, it's on fire. Those are drums of some sort. Oh my god, I actually did predict drum. Or some kind of tonski. Wrong. Let's try again. Oh! Is this Simon Says? something a fucking four-year-old could do but it's very interesting that it makes magic happen um okay what do i need i followed the sequence correctly in my hand i can't get that thing to work i need to cross the river down there anyway for what turn down for what Dude, is that the same Harry hand said it didn't work uh, for him. fifth element that you so put it shouldn't down? work for me either. Unless I think it is. There's something different about my hand. Web it up, girl. Hey, Nora. You know what you've got to do. No, not fifth element. Sorry. Total recall. In Total Recall, where he's on Mars, he has to put his hand down to get oxygen <gasps> in the hands. planet, and I swear it's just Look at this. my hands. This is Pretty definitely sure. not a dream, and I'm starting to doubt the others were dreams, too. Get your ass to Mars. I should be scared, but it's hard to explain what I feel, but it isn't fear. Not a bit. I'm a fish. How do I get out of here? <laughs> I 
I'm a fish. I don't know how to get out of the water. Okay, Another one of those gates, like the one I saw in the temple. <laughs> Actually, how do I get out? What is the? What am I doing? Get me out! Look at this. I like solved all those puzzles, and I can't get out of the water. actually confused. I'm sure that this is not supposed to be hard. Why can't I get out of the water? Yes, I'm missing something obvious. I... Uh... Space bar. I feel like I should just be able to get through this. I feel frustrated. Ah, uh, a uh, button. It is very pretty. It's also very like, what am I doing? Oh God. Bad Andy writes. Thank you for raiding. Hi, everybody. I'm back to being me. Um, Silver, thank you. It's hard for me to understand how these gates work. What happens every time I cross one of them? Bad Andy, thank you for the raid. I really appreciate it. I'm uh, doing some puzz juice tonight. We're playing this game that turns me into a fish frog and then allows me to kind of investigate underwater spaces. I don't know what I'm doing in this space yet because I just kind of started. Um, oh my gosh, I love Soma. Technology. We love for? Soma. I played that on stream. To the currents? You're in for a treat. It's very good. Cool. Okay. How come it only turns two times? They are definitely similar. Soma's special because it's really spoopy and it also has a very powerful purpose. I don't know what this game's purpose is, but um, Soma has like a really good story behind it that I think helps you process all sorts of stuff outside of the game itself. Who's here? Thanks for the follow. Um, I super appreciate um, your raid. I'm probably not going to stream too much longer because I've actually been streaming for about three hours. So I'll probably stop shortly, but I promise I will continue to play this game at a later time. And I'm so grateful, Bad Andy, that you raided me and entrusted me to do something cool. So thank you. Oh, fuck me. It's a raid! Hope I'm not doing anything Min stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Min Max, thank you guys for rating me. How are you? We love Min Max show. You guys are great. I wish I knew what the fuck I was doing. Open sesame. We're trying to do some puzz juice here, but I am heavy struggle town. It's based on currents, is what it sounds like. I'm also a fish frog. Enjoy my fish animations. I am a fish, fishy woman. And then, do 
I undo fish or am I perma fish? These are good questions. It's a very pretty game. What were you guys doing, Min Max? Oh, fuck me. I'm stuck. Okay, here we go. I, where are we? <laughs> okay. I got very stuck when that happened. Um. Hitman challenges with Dan? That sounds fun. I almost played Hitman tonight. I wonder if you guys would want to watch me play Hitman. The problem with me playing Hitman is that I don't know those games very well and I feel like I would just awkwardly get caught a lot because that's what I tend to do when I play um, when I play games where you're supposed to be sneaky I'm not very sneaky <laughs> every time I play a sneaky game I am not sneaky and then uh, thank you guys for raiding stupid I think that was the second raid from MinMax, maybe with the leftover juices. Thanks, MinMax. I appreciate that. So this is about changing. This puzzle is about changing the flow of the water. Rock party. Thanks for subbing. O-M-G-R-A-W-K-P-A-R-T-E-E -E subbed. But I, oh, six months. You get a golden seamount for that. So like, see how, I think you want this to go through it, but what I don't understand is when I push this button, it's not, see how the water is flowing out of it? Yes, you can bet on it. What's confusing to me is that I don't understand. Min Max, thanks for the follow. Hope you guys are having a good time. I don't understand what I'm doing. Is this about pushing it at the same time? an idiot no yes no no okay that wasn't right what just happened did i do it okay Who bet on Mary? Wow. That was definitely not five minutes. I fucking cracked that code immediately. For more code cracking goodness, you stick right here, goddammit. The island is pierced by underground currents. And the only time you'll be like, this is taking way too long is if you already solved the puzzle. And you know what? You ain't that special. You just already solved it. Reasonable amount of time to solve. Good job. That architecture again. Where is this gate going to lead me now? All right, I do want to investigate what the space looks like, but we're definitely not going to get through it because I need to eat dinner. Oh, shit. What a quiet and peculiar place. This game is extraordinarily pretty. Waterfall. Sunset and... Birds, uh, particle effects, spores. Oh, dope! Don, I'm so glad. I love that you guys love watching primitive bowls and plates. I love the Resident uh, Evil series that I've done with Mike. It's a little funny because it's crossed between GameSpot and my personal channel, but it's so much fun to play them, and so I'm grateful that anyone wants to watch the series. It's a joy for me to have learned and played through every Resident Evil, and now every Silent Hill. Um, well, this was cool. This game is great. I hope you guys um, 
like it. This game is really cool. There's a lot going on um, that I like about it. It's a bit um, narrative heavy, which sometimes I think is too much for me because I actually prefer discovering the narrative on my own and not being told. But the Puzz Juice is good. It's doing a lot right. So I'm interested in playing it some more and kind of navigating it. But I think I'd also be down, quite frankly, for playing like um, Amnesia, which is basically this game plus monsters, which is a huge bonus for me. <laughs> I need to try this game. Yeah, it's definitely worth trying, 100%. I think you would like this game and the concept of it a lot. Um, some stuff you have to work through with it, but I think it's worth it in the end. In the work, in the end, I'm very satisfied with it. Um, I am so grateful to you guys for hanging out with me. And I, especially after all those dope raids, i um, so happy that you guys are hanging out with me. I haven't eaten dinner yet, so I'm going to probably um, peace out in a little bit and just eat dinner. But I do go live every Monday uh, to play indie games. And then I typically play horror games on Tuesdays and Thursdays, depending on my schedule and what's going on. So if you like that, um, feel free to drop me a follow. It's free and you can hang out with me. Hey, everyone. Ruby, thanks for the bits. person just gave me some bits. Hi, bud. Sweet. Um, you guys are great. I think, um, I'm going to raid a friend of mine. So I appreciate you guys uh, sweet, very sweet much and hanging out with me. You could be anywhere. Um, but this raid brought you to me like the flow of water that I solved with my puzz brain. So I'm just really happy uh, that sweet, that happened. And I hope that you will hang out with me again sometime. I'm going to... <laughs> raid my friend um let's see who should i raid there's actually i have multiple friends You're, this is gonna shock you i have several friends oh my god is rihanna streaming um my friend rihanna is streaming and she's so dope and she's playing sea of thieves so i think you guys will like her um she's sweet as pie and she's very funny and she just started kind of like streaming full time on her own channel as opposed to like playing on what's good games channel which you guys might be more familiar with i will raid now and i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your week thank you for spending time with me please come back thanks a lot time goes by when you're having fun I still can't believe the stream that's done Going live is no fun without you So check the schedule and Twitter too I like you, so you know But my blood sugar's getting low I'm about to go offline But I'll see you again sometime Put some sea modes in chat. See you again next time. Be cool to the person I raid. I'll know if you're not. Time goes by when you're having fun I still can't believe the stream is done